There was no escape in the rain today, or the winds, or the hail. It's just as bad here at the coast as it was at home, but the view's a lot nicer. And uh, guys, it's just nice to get out after a crazy week and find a bit of solace. I believe that's why God created this world and gave us a, a heart after it. You know, the, the Bible tells us that God created the world. He looked around. Whew, that's better. He looked around and uh, he said it was good. I think we need to get out there more often and enjoy what God said was good. And I'm not going to stop. A little bit of uh, winter weather from letting me do that. Just down at a famous landmark, 20 minutes, 25 minutes, we'll go back in the Winstrom, uh, from where I live, and it's called the White Rocks. It's a place um, beside a little seaside town known as Port Rush. Um, it's a beautiful part of the world, North Antrim coast. Uh, in that direction, the Giant's Causeway. Um, that way take you on around to Donegal and it's a lovely place to come at winter at. I don't like crowds, I don't like fuss and hassle and during the winter I love coming to the beach because there's very few people here. Just let you pan around guys while the wind's just down a bit. This is home. Uh, this is where I would have spent summer holidays. We didn't really get away too far. We would have just come down here and um, played on the beach, donkey rides, had a, an ice cream and a chip, not at the same time, and then head at home. So it always brings back good memories. Um, so I'm just going to head along the beach here, head for a bit of a walk. I love this time of the year when it's so quiet. Take care, guys. Take a chill, guys. Um, I need to be very careful. Tide is flying in, and right now, I'm between a rock and a hard place. <laughs> I need to keep a move on. Uh, oh, it's beautiful down here today. Beautiful. I was saying earlier about my belief, you know, that God created heaven and earth. And you read Genesis and it talks about God dividing the land from the sea. And you come down to a coastline on a stormy day like this. And it sort of gives a bit of a vision to read or what I read. You can just imagine on that day when God decided to divide land from sea. That was a lot worse than this. Inspiring though. Just limestone here. You can see why the, the name. The chalk. The white rocks. And then the sea has just hit away into all these Caves just in the whole way up here. But I better not linger about because if I have to ring and get the girls to come and rescue me. Uh, into the 
city. Just uh, grabbing a seat to catch my breath back. Had to really scramble across the rocks there. Uh, I've never seen the tide come in as quick. I wasn't in danger, I just didn't want to get stuck. But uh, all the rocks, because there have been such high tides over winter, are completely covered in algae and it didn't make for a, an easy scramble. <laughs> oh, that's good. Uh, Just the roar of the sea in the background. There's nothing like it. Okay guys. Um, we're having a family day out. Just down at the, the North Antrim coast today. And the benefits of having a wee, wee bit of preparation in your life. Well, this is my EDC bag. Um, this is my get home bag. You've seen them, well, you've seen this before in a good video. I uh, haven't done a review on this one yet, but we're out for a family day. Um, we're down at the coast and we want a brew. And we've got the get home bag with us so I can quickly knock up a, a brew and uh, a wee bit of uh, supplies to keep us going just while we're down here. And that's just really, a lot of guys think, you know, this whole prepper, being prepared, survivalist, uh, we're constantly thinking about the worst case scenario and what can go wrong but for me it's just really now having a, a way of being self-sufficient uh, it's the, it's winter months there's nowhere handy to get a coffee there's nowhere handy to get a cup of tea so uh, we've got the jet boil we've got our own water and we've got a brew kit and that's how simple it is just to look after yourselves that's why I prep so that uh, even on good days I have what I need to get by.